Renault dropped big news at Monza, with the squad announcing it would rebrand as Alpine F1 team from 2021, pumping up the French sports car mark that helped create its sport division. The change came to begin with in promoting its little-known model A110 and aligning with its storied motorsport pedigree, originally in rallies but more recently in endurance racing, with LMP2 and soon LMP1 cars in the FIA World Endurance Championship, with the Tricolore to also feature on its Formula One car, to be raced by Fernando Alonso and Esteban Ocon next year, a sign of French excellence. It's also a reflection of restructuring at parent Renault, which has suffered during the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic, forcing it to slash budgets by 2 billion euros and jobs around 15,000 worldwide. With a new direction to develop its organization around brands, which it's grouped into four autonomous business units, Renault, Dacia, Alpine, and New Mobility, aimed at simplicity and results. With Cyril Abitable heading up Alpine, broadening his role beyond the racetrack, potentially enabling him to share costs across business units. And while some might say that the move allows Renault to exit stage left, with the French mark relegated to power unit supplier, in reality, Renault retains control, and the team will still run from Enstone and Very Chatillon, but with lower expectations and a bigger marketing bang with the brand yet to hit mainstream. Thanks for watching. To stay up to speed on all things Formula One, make sure you hit the subscribe button.